Uh, hello friends, today in this tutorial I will be telling you that how to make a downloadable PDF document inside your Angular 9 application using JS PDF library. So first of all you need to install this library by executing this simple command which is npm install JS PDF dash dash save. I have already downloaded this library by executing this command. So just execute this command in the inside the co command prompt. And now after that go back to app.component.html file of your Angular 9 project. And inside this make a div which has a class of uh, let me also uh, remove this div and we have only this an input tag of type text and I will also be giving a placeholder to text and after that we will be having a simple button which will be having a label of a download PDF so basically if I refresh the application so basically it will build this application now to build the application it is very easy it is just building this you can see that compiled successfully so now if i refresh the application you will see that there is an input field and a download pdf button and now we just need to bind a simple ng model directive to this so which will be ng model ng model and this will be equal to the text like this and also in order to use this ng model we need to make a slight modification inside our app.module folder inside this we need to uh, import the forms module inside angular so import from and there is at the rate angular slash forms so these are the module that you need to import it and inside this there is a module which is forms module so import this and after that go to the import statement as well and import this module as well so just write this forms module here and now you can use this ng model directive like this and also we just need to bind a on click on the button as well so when we click the button we need to execute this download function like this so when we click the button we need to down uh, click the execute this download function now we need to move to this app.component.typescript file and here we just first of all need to grab the library that we have installed import star as a jspdf from jspdf like this so now we are successfully importing this library that we have downloaded and now we just need to go to the export class app component and here we just need to declare a variable which will be of type text so right here text and colon so basically this will be of type string is equal to nothing like this and now we have declared a variable and now inside this we need to execute execute our download function and uh, here we just need to define it so first of all we will be making a new instance of uh, jspdf new jspdf like this and in order to add some text to the pdf document we will be using this function which is uh, doc.text this is a function and here we just need to get our variable which is this.text so basically we can access this variable which is there inside the class by this keyword and this text will be coming here from the input field so whatever be the user writes here it will be stored inside this text method and now we just need to provide the x and the y coordinate so 10 comma 10 and now in order to save the file as an attachment we can execute this uh, doc dot save method and here you can just give a file name let's suppose i give this file name as output dot pdf and the application is complete now now let me just see it is compiled successfully automatically and now if i reload the application and if i write anything here hi hello world if I click download PDF so it will download it as an attachment you can see that output.pdf if I open this file the same text is printed out hi hello world I can repeat the process once again I can manipulate more text here download PDF once again it will download it and you can see that and in this tutorial we have seen that how to create a downloadable PDF document using the JS PDF library in Angular 9 applications. So thanks very much for watching this video. If you like this video, then please hit the like button, subscribe the channel, and I will be seeing you in the next video.